Hey, what's up guys? I am Friendly Developer and today I'm here to tell you how to extract the vocal part and the music or karaoke part from any song that you like. This is a machine learning and AI based uh, solution that is very recently released and this method works for a lot of songs. I have tested it for a lot of songs and this works fantastic. So I'm really excited to show you guys how this tool works. Okay. All right, let's look at an example. I, I have a song from Jonathan Colton here. Let's listen to this song. Hey, you Tom, it's Bob from the office down the hall. It's good to see you, buddy. How have you been? So that is the song uh, which contains both the vocal part and the music part. Once we use the tool uh, and uh, get separate the vocal and the accompaniment part, uh, we'll get the vocal and the car okay like this so let's listen to how it sounds okay this is the music and this is the vocal part hey you Tom it's Bob from the office down the hall it's good to see you buddy how have you been as you can see, the result is fantastic. I was blown away the first time I saw this result. So uh, let's look into the tool on how to convert your song into vocal and the music. All right, the tool that we'll be using is called Splitter. This is an excellent tool. It's working awesome as you saw. Let's uh, see how you can install it and use it to split your song. Okay, so uh, if you're on Linux, just open a terminal and uh, the prerequisite to install splitter is you should have python installed you need to have python and something called pip installed so once you install it uh, we're ready to install splitter okay so i'm giving pip install splitter i have the python 3 version of pip which is called pip 3 pip 3 install splitter just do this and wait for a while splitter will get installed uh, I have already installed Splitter, that, so it didn't take much time. Alright, if you are on Windows, I suggest you install Python on Windows. So I suggest a Python 3 uh, version. And uh, once you install Python, just open a command prompt and uh, type this command to install Splitter. So the command is pip install Splitter. This will install Splitter and until it does, just wait for it. All right, once you have installed Splitter, it's time to use it. Uh, how do you use Splitter? It's as simple as saying Splitter and what do we need to do? We need to separate. Okay, you open the terminal in the folder which contains your song. Once you open the terminal, uh, you this is how you use the tool. So this is the command splitter space separate and uh, let's specify the input file which is the song that we are talking about this is the uh, name of the file and the output we want it to be present in the folder called output okay so the output you specify with the dash o option press enter and wait for some time all right now the processing is done splitter has given us the output folder let's have a look into this so these are the two files that we have got one is the vocal part hey you Tom, it's bob why you folks might has really wish you let us so this is the vocal part and this is the music part that's it for this video this is how you convert uh, any song this works for a all the songs that I have tried and you should also try it out before you uh, go on searching for new songs karaoke and whatnot and uh, give up finding the right ones you should definitely uh, make your own karaoke using this tool now splitter is not only capable of uh, extracting the vocal and the music part it can also uh, extract separate drum tracks and bass tracks and let's say the music has a piano in, in its background it can uh, extract all these tracks uh, if you want to do that, if you want to extract more than two tracks, you can specify the dash P option and uh, write this splitter colon. The default option was two stems which uh, split the song into two tracks, the vocal and non-vocal part. If you want more tracks, you can use either four stems or five stems. These are the options uh, that are currently supported in splitter. 
that's how you can uh, split your song into multiple different tags each of which will represent corresponding instruments all right that's it for this video if you guys found it useful please like and don't forget to subscribe see you guys next time